permission to write really good stories. All we need is to look around because the stories are there. Oh, thank you. Please just pass the mic on to my sister here. Ladies and gentlemen, Mercy Night Joe again. Tell us what was your experience like being a part of this video series? Um, first, I would like to say thank you all for coming. Uh, I appreciate you. Thank you for coming to see this. This is definitely a start. You know, this what you see here is nothing compared to what is coming. This is the start of something so big, so huge. If you know reward, you know he's a very passionate person. If this was put with so much work, so much um, effort, so much passion. So please, uh, I would encourage you to read the book. You know, please try to catch up with the book. You will understand better. And I also want you to trust him in this process and to support him. That's too yeah. <laughs> Thank you for that. That's true. Please, your support is very important. So, what was your experience like being in this video series, especially how to play that role? Yes. Well, like I said earlier, Reward is very passionate. You know, he sent me this book. I met him at an award, and uh, he had me see this, and he said he wanted us to do it. it. It's something I hadn't done before. As a matter of fact, it's something I haven't seen before. So I was excited to come in. Uh, it's exciting to work with him, and uh, especially work with somebody you know that has so much drive, so much passion for his craft, his act. So the whole of it was just what, and I'm so happy to be you know, part of this, especially because it's the first episode. I'm hoping, and I know for a fact that other episodes will be awesome. So I'm just, I'm just here for it. Thank you. So I'm going to ask this question to the both of you, since you have the mic. If you have been to any wedding. What are some things you've seen that were like a big red flag to you at a wedding? I, I'm going to be honest, I haven't been to a lot of weddings. I usually don't like to play dress up for the weddings. But this kind of situation is a turn on. And I am an actual bride real life. You know what will happen. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god, the drama. What about your incidents? Have you been to a wedding where you saw a big no no or you said this might be a big mistake happening? Not a part of the bride and groom. Um, <laughs> I was just telling them earlier that I went. I actually worked at a wedding, and it was a really, really high-profile wedding. Uh, I'm talking like, think about top five richest men in the world. It was his daughter, <laughs> not Jack Lewis. Um And at the end of the day, they ran out of. They were kind of running out of food. It was such an expensive wedding. They went to McDonald's to buy fries and serve McDonald's fries to the guests. Wow. <laughs> I mean, that's so it's yeah? <laughs> wow. So not only do you find mistakes in the bride and groom, but you can find mistakes in the actual wedding. And she says they served McDonald's because they ran out of food. That is crazy. Oh my god. Top five so, richest men in the world. I'm not joking. And they have money with top five richest men in the world. They ran out of food. God is good. <laughs> All right.